How are you gonna survive without bacon? Wow! No, I'm serious. How are you gonna survive without bacon? I mean, you can't cook. The wife's out of town. And let's be honest, this head was uh, not made for grease protection. So what do we do? There's the bacon. And instead of using the frying pan, I've got a little surprise. The Bacon Master. Yes, folks, you need the perfect knife, the perfect gun, and bacon. <laughs> okay, I think we've had enough fun here today. I just wanted to uh, show you the gift that my nieces got me for my birthday. And I really love the looks of it. I don't know how it's going to work, but uh, it, it sounds really good. It says you can basically cook bacon like a toaster. It drains the fat off of it. And... Um, and it cooks it evenly without without uh, without turning it. So you know, no grease splatter. Just put it on there. But we'll see. Okay, it's a pretty simple setup here. It's just uh, simply a place to put your bacon on. It's actually, genius. I don't know why I didn't think of this. I mean, all you do is hang the bacon over top of it. It's going to heat up. Okay, let's go over the functions. First of all, if you want to preheat, uh, you're going to turn this up to preheat, and it's going to click until it gets all the way down to the bottom. You got the preheat and then you've got traditional and crispy. Now this isn't a perfect process. Obviously they even say that different bacon cuts are going to be different but uh, I'm going to I'm going to put mine at a little bit past traditional. In fact I'm going to just put it right to just the edge of crispy. Pretty simple. You just put the bacon on there and of course obviously be careful don't burn yourself. I'm not an expert in cooking. In fact, this is the first time I've ever cooked bacon. So, we're about to see here. But now, we close it up. Make sure it's good and sealed. And we wait. Okay, I had an idea here. Why not, while this is cooking over here, why not fry up the bacon in the pan? Now, I'm no expert, but surely to goodness, I can fry two strips of bacon in a pan. So, I'm just going to turn this on, and I'm really going to have the camera lady, who knows a little bit more about cooking, to help me and assist me once I turn the camera off. And that looks pretty good. So, let's take that back. And, of course, everybody likes their bacon cooked differently. But I like the looks of this so far. Okay, here we have the finished product. On the left, we have the frying pan cooked bacon, traditional style. And here we have the Bacon Master. And I do want to note something. Uh, the regular produced three sheets of grease when we drained the grease. Whereas the Bacon Master only produces a small amount of grease because it drains it automatically. Less grease, the more healthy the bacon is going to be for you. Okay, let's first try the traditional. Mm. It's delicious. It's very crispy. Very good. Okay, now let's try the Bacon Master. Mm. It actually tastes a little bit better. I kid you not. <laughs> I can actually tell there's not as much grease in this. Yeah, I mean, this this looks better, actually. Looking at it, this looks better. But this actually tastes better. Mmm. That's good. Mmm. It's really good. It really is. Let's try the other one. Mm. 
it's just a, just a little bit better. You can just get a little more of a taste to it. It's got a little more of that bacon taste. Okay, that ends our test. It was very clear, and I had the wife just to confirm as well, and she 100% agreed. The Bacon Master is better than the frying pan. I survived with the Bacon Master. not try this at home. <laughs> Definitely do not try this at home.